we're obviously totally delighted to be hosting the first Suffolk medal ceremony here right at the heart of the county and this is obviously the beginning founding a new tradition for Suffolk. Welcome to everyone and it's no coincidence that the sun is shining because this is probably one of the most auspicious events in the year. The very, very special inaugural investiture of the Suffolk Medal. The Suffolk Medal will enable those people who performed outstanding deeds to take their place in the history of our county. We're very modest in Suffolk, people don't shout about what they do and this is a great opportunity to learn what some people do above and beyond, behind the scenes and to applaud that and thank them. You know, the voluntary sector, hold, it's like the glue that holds the whole county together. Strip it out, we'd all fall apart. And all three of our winners today have done utterly remarkable things. Well, it's long overdue, isn't it? Actually, uh, you know, we're not very good at celebrating our own successes in this county. So something like this initiative has only got to be a very good thing. I think it's extremely important and I think it's just such a lovely gesture that we have this beautiful medal now to recognise the great work that people are doing. Suffolk is a very humble county and its people are, but actually we've got lots to shout about. I think the difficulty is actually who you choose to get the medal. The more stories we can tell, the more we can be inspired, the more volunteers can be inspired to see what they could do too. Still a little bit amazed that, um, that I'm one of the first recipients of, uh, of this wonderful medal. Uh, but very proud. Uh, it can't get any better than being recognised by your own county. Um, enormous pride, uh, uh, preceded by surprise, I have to say. Quite amazing. I'm quite overwhelmed by it all. It's just been such a lovely morning and people have been so kind and I still feel amazed to be getting it. But I'm just thrilled to have received it and I feel it's very much on behalf of all the charities with whom I work. So thank you all very much for making it happen. I know them all very well uh, by working with them over the years, and yet I never fail to be surprised of the totality of their giving to Suffolk. And if we can just look around and give this gift to people that deserve it, not only will they benefit from it and feel wonderful, you will equally feel wonderful to nominate them. Well, I think they're a huge inspiration. Um, and in their own ways, they've, they've done such different things in their lives, but all for the greater good. And um, I hope they are an inspiration to the others who are attending today, most notably the young school children. And, and I really do want them to go into the schools and to show off their Suffolk medal to the school assemblies and to describe to the school children, you know, what it is that they've done. I urge the people of Suffolk to really consider who is doing that fantastic work in their community and put forward a nomination so that they get the right justification and recognition of what they're doing. Someone within your community may be the winner of a Suffolk medal.